Hello everyone. Today we will understand about the linearity property of Z transform. The linearity property of Z transform states that if X1N Z transform is X1Z and X2N Z transform is x to z then a1 x1n plus a2 x2n as z transform is equal to a1 x1z plus a2 x2z where a1 and a2 are the constant coefficients. So let us prove this theorem. We know from the Z transform formula that Z transform of X of N is equal to X of Z, which is equal to summation N is equal to minus infinite to infinite x of n z to the power minus n now we have a function a1 x1 n plus a2 x2 n so z transform of a1 x1 n plus a2 x2 n is equal to summation n is equal to minus infinite to infinite a1 x1n plus a2 x2n z to the power minus n now this can be written as summation n is equal to minus infinite to infinite a1 x1n z to the power minus n plus summation n is equal to minus infinite to infinite a2 x2 n z to the power minus n as this whole function is the summation of two different functions a1 x1 n and a2 x2 n we have used two different summations for these two functions now a1 is a constant and it can be taken out of the summation and similarly a2 is a constant and it can be taken out of the summation a1 summation n is equal to minus infinite to infinite x1 n z to the power minus n plus a2 summation n is equal to minus infinite to infinite x2 n z to the power minus n now x1 n is a time domain function and its z transform will always be equal to x1 z x2 n is the time domain function and its z transform will be x2 n and the coefficients a1 and a2 hence proved so in this way we can prove the linearity property of z transform now let us see one numerical with the help of linearity property question is determine the z transform of x of n is equal to 2 u of n plus 5 u of minus n minus 1 with the help of linearity property now how to solve such type of questions the basic function is u of n which is a unit state function and we know from the previous class 
the Z transform of if the time domain function x of n is equal to a to the power n u of n then the Z transform of x of n is equal to Z by Z minus a and region of convergence is mod Z is greater than a and Z transform of and if the function is minus b to the power n u of minus n minus 1 then the z transform of this function will be z upon z minus b and mod z is less than b now u of n can be written as 1 to the power n u of n and its z transform will always be equal to z upon z minus 1 and mod z is greater than 1 and similarly z transform of u of minus n minus 1 will be z upon z minus 1 and mod z is less than 1 so let us find out the solution write down the most basic function u of n z transform is z upon z minus 1 u of minus n minus 1 z transform is minus z by z minus 1 here you have to put 1 1 you have, you have to put one minus two times of u of n plus five times of u of minus n minus one z transform will be two times of z upon z minus one minus five times of z upon z minus one according to the linearity property the coefficients 2 and 5 which are multiplied with the individual function in the time domain will again be multiplied with the transformed function so in this way we can solve a numerical on linearity property thank you